What's good in the hit y'all? It's your homie back again with another video. What's up guys? It's been a long time. I know. I'm so sorry, man. Did I miss any holidays? Happy Valentine's Day. Happy President's Day. Happy uh, Martin Luther King Day. Happy New Year's. Happy Lunar New Year's. And yeah, I've been really busy lately, so I haven't been shooting any videos or making any reviews and stuff like that. Bear with me. I'm so sorry, but it is great to be back. I am back with another video. Like I said, I don't know if I said that yet, but further ado, enough of me talking. Let's get into the product that I want to share with you guys in this video today. Boom! There we go. Yes, sir. It is another messenger bag yeah a messenger slash satchel bag slash man bag slash whatever bag you want to call it yeah buddy so i saw this on amazon for like 21.99 plus tax so about like roughly 24 bucks mid quality i would say type of bag right here pretty nice man let me just go over a little bit of details with it this is a canvas style bag the material is canvas it is made by a company called c chunk that's the funny uh, name, but yeah, I noticed that there's a whole bunch of different type of company or brand for this particular bag right here. It's essentially the same bag, but just different uh, logo, or maybe it's the same logo, but just different naming or branding, whatever it is. They're all the same, different prices as well. That's what I've seen. The color that I chose is obviously black. They have different colors like brown or coffee or whatever. I went for this color just because it's more sleek and it is easy to pair with almost any outfit you have on everybody has different styles so you know it is what it is okay oh snap dude you just gotta mess around with it and uh, it has a little pocket in there okay all right okay okay i also made a separate video of like full reveal on it sorry about that i just figured it out right now i have a comparison real quick this is my other satchel bag or messenger bag whatever this one has no padding in it so you can basically do this to the bag you know what i mean this one you can't really you could fold it like this but you can't you know bend it the other way like that you can't fold it you only can roll it up kind of if that makes any sense as it's ups and downs you know what i mean it just really depends on you the height going from the top to the bottom is about 10 inches or 10.3 inches the length side to side is about 13.5 inches one of those i don't know you can't put a laptop in here i don't even think you can put a 13 inch laptop in here it might be too tight <laughs> I'm not gonna say anything. You can, in fact, put in a tablet, an iPad, or an iPad Pro. You can fit that, no problem, right into this bag, okay? Now, I'm gonna put in the reveal proportion of this video. Why does that sound so weird? I don't know, anyways, next clip. All right, further ado, guys, this is the bag. This is how it looks like. It just looked like any ordinary bag. I went with the black color just because it's more sleek and it matches with everything. What you would notice right off the bat is that there is a little zipper here and a little logo right here. It says fight for love, fight for life, C chunk. So what I noticed about this bag is that they have multiple brand, okay? Essentially, they're all the same bags. It's just different brand, I guess. And each one has a different badging. It looks the same from what I've seen, but it's just a different company, I guess. I, I don't know why they do that, but you can find a whole bunch of these on Amazon, almost roughly about the same price. Yeah, it's, it's not too bad. Okay, enough about that badge. Let's go to the zipper real quick. I wanna point this out that it is not really a big pocket, okay? That's, that's it. It can fit like maybe a pen. Here's a pen. Yep, that's it, barely. Maybe like two pens. That's about it. You can't even put anything else in there. All right, moving on. Let's go to uh, the back of this bag. This is a canvas bag, by the way. The material is canvas. Just want to point that out. The material is actually pretty okay. Not too cheap. It does have a hard little padding on the bottom, which is pretty nice to have. I have another messenger bag, satchel bag, whatever you want to call it, that doesn't have that. But the quality do feel a little bit better you see that they have another zipper and this one is cool because it actually has a pocket yeah you can put like your wallet or your phone in there i got my phone right here you put that in there boom boom i'm rocking one of these wallets right here the mini size or whatever it's called i don't know 
that fits perfectly in there as well and when you wear it you know it's gonna be on your your hip anyways or your side so nobody can try to pickpocket you all right let's go back to the front let's talk about the strap real quick or whatever this thing is called it's on the cheaper side back in the day if you guys ever had one of those belts that have like the little clip on you know what i mean like you just loop in the the strap and you just pull it and it hangs like that yeah it feels just like that <laughs> on the lower side okay not the higher end it would be nice if it had like these clips so i can just like unhook it and unhook it just because you know i feel like that's more better in my opinion but this right here it is clipped on to this metal bracket thing i forgot what this is called maybe it's called a slider i know this is called like some type of slider this part right here is leather which is nice now let's get into the bag or inside the bag okay so what you notice once i open it is that they are stuck together by velcro which is pretty cool you know it gets the job done i went with the velcro over the little buckle thing is because i just want to be able to close it and then not worry about it you know what i mean i would like this to have like the magnet the magnet clip-ons those are pretty cool for 20 bucks it is what it is man but yeah the velcros are pretty nice it's not too sticky it gets the job done like i said and then right here you get two pockets one on the left one on the right decent side pockets not too big not too small also put your phone in there your wallet or your keys whoa, whoa, whoa. anything you want for easier access now you can do it like that if you want or and take that part right here close that and it's not going anywhere you know what i mean maybe your wallet i don't know i don't you wouldn't want to do that anyways okay to the main pocket right here boom boom you get the zipper right here which is pretty cool going into the bag pretty spacious no not too crowded not too wide it also has two pockets in here on the right side Right here, you can also put your wallet or your phone, whatever you want. Your essentials, maybe not your phone. <laughs> that was poking out. Hand sanitizer, wipes, chapsticks, whatever. And then you also have another pocket right here on the left side. This one has a zipper, which is pretty cool. You can put your keys in there, put anything you want. And just the big, big pocket itself right there. You can't fit a laptop in here, okay? I just want to point that out. You can fit an iPad Pro, which is like the 12.9 inch. Yeah, you can fit that one, no problem. Other than that, I don't think you can fit like a 13 inch. You can try, but I highly doubt you can. You can. Yeah, all oh, the dimensions, length of it, or is this the width? Okay, so well, the height of this bag right here is 10 inch and the length of this bag is about 13 inch that's what it says on the descriptions but yeah guys this is the bag i think it's pretty cool for what it is it's not too bad the build quality could be better for what it is 20 bucks not bad at all and it's nice comfortable oh there was a few cons that i had with this bag the first one being that this thing right here is not even a pocket and another thing is that it gets heavy okay i know i just said that it's comfortable but when you have like multiple things in here it will get uncomfortable i did wear this out all i had in it was my wallet my phone a water bottle and my gopro hero 9 with my little tripod and that thing was heavy dude i was like what the heck oh and my keys and i was just all like whoa it's uh pretty heavy but you know I don't know maybe these bags are just like for lighter things you know so like not the water bottle maybe not this maybe you can't get away with this maybe just this <laughs> i don't know <laughs> yeah i noticed it was getting a little bit uncomfortable it wasn't too bad but you can definitely tell now let me get my other bag so i can do a comparison all right here we go sorry guys if i sound like i'm tired i am tired i haven't been sleeping but it's okay i've been going to the gym and you know just trying to be healthy but anyways this is my other satchel bag messenger bag whatever you want to call it it is also canvas this one i got at target my sister got it at target for me for like i think 30 bucks at the time this one has these magnetic clips which i wasn't a big fan of i'm not too fond of these i rather just have you know this part being magnetic and then so when i close it it'll just automatically you know clap together claps together clap click ah i don't know you get what i'm saying but yeah this one you have to like kind of maneuver it so it can get to the right spot like i'm doing right now and sometimes you know that takes too much time 
And then most of the time when I'm wearing these type of bags that, that has these two type of clips, I just, I tend to just leave one unclicked. Well, it, it just depends on the preferences. If you like it, hey, more power to you. If you don't, that's fine. But this one right here, what I like about this bag is I like the straps right here. This one feels more durable, more stronger, and also has this little padding thing, this leather padding thing for your shoulder. If you have multiple things in here that are heavy, that weighs you down, this right here will keep your shoulder from, you know, feeling fatigue or just like bruising up and stuff like that. That's one thing I wish the other bag had. C-Chunk don't have it, but it would have been nice if it did. You feel me? And then inside here, it has two pockets just like the C chunks, but I modded this bag. It doesn't come with these Velcros. I uh, took these, bought it from Michaels, super glued them on. Yeah, just for, you know, a bit more protection. Same thing with this. It did not come with a zipper. Went to Michaels, bought these, and I had my girlfriend sew them on. Thank you very much, boo boo. It looks amazing. You know, it's always nice to have a little uh, zipper to hold everything in place. It also has this little flap, little pocket right here, this little pouch. Pretty nice as well. You know what I'm saying? It's not bad of a bag. You can just crumple this and it just, just throw on your back. You know, this one is more like sturdy just because of the padding on the bottom that it has. This one has no padding on the bottom whatsoever. By side comparison or overlay, whatever you want to call it. Okay, okay. I believe this bag right here is a little bit bigger, just by like a couple of centimeters. Uh, a top camera going on right here. I don't know. Bada bing, bada boom. Yep. These are the messenger bags. These are my messenger bags that I went with. I know there's other brands that are like way better. I, I've seen a lot of nutsack. I know that's a funny word, but yeah, supposedly that one is like a, a better brand and it's expensive. That's why I didn't go for it. You know, I, I just wanted something that works, that looks nice, not too expensive, which is this right here. You can get this one on Amazon for like $21.99. There's other ones for like 25 bucks. I'm not sponsored, okay? Same, it's a good deal and y'all know me. I love me a good deal, all right? Yeah, if you wanna add one of these to your collection, you know to your style to your swagger i will be leaving a link down below it is an affiliated link it will help support my channel and i will be so grateful to you guys for that now let's get back to the other blades yeah and we are back all right guys hopefully you guys like that video hopefully this video helped you guys out in any way and if it did please smash that like button smash smash so please subscribe to your homie for more content like this or anything else i do on this channel but once again i'm so sorry for not being active on my youtube channel i've been so tired so busy just trying to get back into the flow of things once again if you guys want this bag i will be sure to leave the link down below for it it's a bang for your buck type of thing type of item type of deal type of whatever you guys want to call it man if you guys are into these type of bags i suggest you guys pick one up because it's pretty good like i said in the video i know there are other brands like nutsack that's also a funny word i don't feel like dropping like 300 bucks for a bag you know what i'm saying if i miss anything else and if you guys have any questions or anything be sure to leave a comment down below i read everything and i try my best to reply back to everyone okay and yeah that's about it with that being said y'all be safe keep it breezy and i'll see y'all in the future Deuces. Yarrami. Satchel bag. The messenger bag. Oh, it got stuck. Hero bag.